The Caraclear artificial cornea is the only minimally invasive foldable artificial cornea that is designed to be placed into a non-penetrating corneal pocket. Placement of the Caraclear only requires removal of approximately 5% of the recipient corneal tissue. The new XT models of the Caraclear artificial cornea can now be implanted at variable depths to treat a wide variety of corneal conditions. Depths range from 200 to 700 microns in 100 micron steps to allow customized treatment of keratoconus, stromal corneal opacities, and corneal edema. In figure A, we see a side view and top-down view of a diseased cornea. The femtosecond laser is used to create a corneal pocket at a depth which removes most of the corneal pathology and which leaves at least 100 microns of posterior corneal stroma. The femtosecond laser is also used to create a vertical trephination incision up to the depth of the corneal pocket. In figure B, a central anterior disc of diseased corneal tissue is removed. In figure C, the caraclear is brought onto the operative field using blunt forceps. In figure D, the caraclear is gently inserted into the corneal pocket using blunt instruments and the skirt is unfurled for 360 degrees. In figure E, the caraclear is optionally sutured by passing partial thickness tenonylon sutures through the holes in the skirt. The femtosecond laser is used to create a 8.0 millimeter diameter corneal pocket as well as a 3.5 millimeter trephination incision. 0.12 millimeter forceps are then used to remove the diseased disc of corneal tissue. A blunt spatula is then used to sweep the recesses of the corneal pocket to make sure there are no adhesions. The Caraclear XT artificial cornea is then brought onto the operative field using blunt forceps. A blunt spatula is then used to tuck the skirt of the Caraclear XT into the recesses of the corneal pocket. Care is taken to unfurl all 360 degrees of the skirt into the pocket. A bandage contact lens is then placed over the eye. Here we see a case of a Caraclear XT that was placed into a failed corneal transplant. The patient was able to achieve 20-40 vision. Here we see the use of the Caraclear XT in a case of corneal scarring. Note the clear central cornea after replacement of all of the scarred tissue by the Caraclear XT. Here we see a patient with a central corneal dystrophy in a patient with radial keratotomy. Note how much clearer the central cornea is after Caraclear XT surgery. The Caraclear is the first commercially available non-penetrating artificial cornea. Non-penetrating surgery has the advantage of avoiding serious complications, including endophthalmitis, glaucoma, and retroprosthetic membrane. These patients also have a fast visual recovery. Studies have shown that there's a 90% retention rate over four years for the Caraclear. 
The Caraclear XT can be used to replace tissue from 200 to 700 micron depth. This allows a broader range of patients to be effectively treated. Patients with corneal edema, such as those with failed corneal grafts, can obtain good visual acuity despite their corneal edema. Patients with keratoconus can avoid or delay transplantation. Importantly, the Caraclear XT does not take away the options of either penetrating keratoplasty or deep anterior lamellar keratoplasty. Thank you for your attention.